<laughs> Sorry. Whenever you're ready. The show is called Revival, Millennial Remembering in the Afro Now. Revival, Millennial Remembering in the Afro Now. Revival, Millennial Remembering in the Afro Now. And it is a site-specific ritual performance experience. Is an experience that transcends the confines of like a theater show or a dance show or a vocal performance. That is looking at the history of CBPA, which is the Committee on Black Performing Arts, and really looking at the activist history of this university. So in the rehearsals, what we're really trying to do is have this multi-layered experience inside of the rehearsal where we are embodying and seeking to embody the energy that it requires when one is catalyzing a movement. What is the pressure that you feel when you make a shift and then things change? So we've been exploring ideas of endurance, exploring ideas of love, connection, vulnerability, and all of that is under the guise of ritual. Ritual is really about a practice of creating a kind of energy that moves people, the ones who are actually practicing it and those who experience it. It calls upon history, the present, and the future, all to be in conversation about what it means to be Black and Indigenous, um, not only in the space of Stanford, but historically. I would say it's a very magical experience. Um, there's audience interaction, which I think inherently gives way to such a magical experience because the energy every single night is going to be so different. So Revival celebrates the 50th anniversary of the Committee on Black Performing Arts. This was coming out of a rich um, activist history at the swell of the civil rights movement. Um, and the students at that time knew that arts and cultural expressions were the kind of root of that history and being able to bring it into the present moment. And so Ida, um, but really CBPA, was a way of solidifying diverse voices, black voices, black aesthetics on this campus and having them root deep within the academics of the university. So Amar Tabor Smith is Ida's artist in residence. She works with us in a multi-year capacity, really having deep engagement with student artists, but also bringing the networks um, of local artists, emerging artists, uh, mid-career artists that are working in the Bay Area, and bringing the kind of porosity of the university back into the, the fold of what we do at Ida. It is an extremely powerful experience for anyone who is able to see it as it has called upon so many of the spirits and the creative minds um, from the students as well as Amara, as well as our wonderful visiting artists. Um, and it's truly just like out of this world. It's been transformative for me. It has transformed the way I think about performance and healing and ritual. So as I was saying that revival is an experience, it's an experience. It is not just theater or dance. Uh, or even ritual, but a combination of these things intended to shift a vibration inside of the theater that hopefully will be felt both by the performers and the audience that participate and witness. Through this experience, people leave feeling changed. <laughs>